Hello everyone, welcome back to the channel, Hoot Gamer here. We're looking at our Anno 1800 series, um, our, well, some of our fleet are hanging around here uh, by the docks. Um, it is something that I was kind of thinking about. Um, they're no longer really needed as such, um, because obviously we've only bent. Uh, I think even with the guys that we've we've got left, we could go to war with Benta. But we're not gonna do that, right? Because, uh, well, I mean, if we do, that's the end of it. I could... I guess we could. Um, but I think um, I have a better idea. Um, so, with the mods causing some of the issues, I've noticed that the uh, embassy building that we've had here had disappeared. <laughs> so... Um, anyway, I just placed it there and it's gonna be rebuilt, so that's fine. Uh, but let's just take a quick look. The, the World Fair has now finished. As we were fighting. Yeah, perfect. Okay. Sail somewhere to receive a gift. A gift should... Yeah, there it is. Oh, okay. Oh, these are... Good items. Okay, and um, happiness. Oh, 100% reduced consumption. Okay. I've not seen that before. And I fix clockmakers and jewelers. Okay. Uh, the other one is very good, but um, that one is not really needed. No, the hotel is affected, right? Because we have lost uh, stuff on this island. So that's uh, basically what's what's going on here. Um, but... Back to what I was thinking of. Um, just can't remember where it was. I think it's here. Uh, the AI shipyard. Okay. So what we're gonna do is to place it back. Okay, and will we get back, yeah, we could get back one of those guys, so Hugo is already here, obviously that's fine, uh, yeah, let's go for Beryl, I do like her. Okay, not sure what's that about. Soon, new uh, this is still not Intriguing. finished. I guess Intriguing. this would need to be uh, because the it, I, I just think that that's what it is. The because her icon is here, whatever. So I feel a certain uh, okay, just a bus stop is what we need. Uh, I'm sure there's one somewhere nearby. Um, this is really just temp. I'm not planning for the... Unless we are. It's hard to say, to be honest. Farmers? Didn't know we still had the blighters. Come to think of it, did see some wretches plodding about the estate. Probably yeah, we've everything, so that's fine. Okay. Let's just dismiss these guys. I do like my expeditions. So, oh, okay. Yeah, I know what it is. Yeah, banana and whatever. That's fine. They're not needed. And that is buying shares. I'm sure you do a much better job with So the that's good. Guy. Right, okay. Um so we need to fix up this island uh, quite fast because we are lacking grapes, the jam and something else. I actually I actually can't remember what what else was it. This island is now called something else. We won't be renaming it for the moment, so that's okay. But what we need 
<laughs> it's again Docklands. So that's um, that's a bit of a bummer. Um, but I want to be sure. Yeah, okay. So that's fine. The, the steel though. Okay, yeah. So the steel should be... Yeah, he's just there. The steel will be delivered shortly, but we'll we'll definitely load up the the guys that are just Hi. standing here waiting for nothing, and then we'll send them over and start getting the the Docklands. Now I do, I I I I won't be going through the uh, actual. Time lapse because there's no need. You guys have seen the Docklands so many times, I'm sure. So I'm just gonna cut it out. Okay guys, and we are back. Uh, we have a um, couple of things done. Uh, you can see all of it. Uh, I'm back with uh, the jam. The uh, vineyards are set up as well. We're just waiting for some delivery of oil for that to kick off. Um, I just realized the workers. Oh, it may be because of this. Yeah, 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 yeah. Okay. That's the issue. So that's okay. Let's just um, upgrade this many. Yeah, perfect. Okay. So that's fine. And in the meantime as well, I went to the New World um, to have kind of this island started, right? Because we need um, the uh, orchids, right? Because you can see here what's going on with the population. Uh, orchids are needed for perfumes and things like that, and that's what's lacking. And it's um, it's it's affecting us in Cape Trelawney as well. So we want to uh, get that up and running as soon as possible. And now, what's going to be happening? is I actually don't know if I had any other items apart from this girl here which which she's needed for the butterflies uh, I might have I might have had some but I can't remember so uh, what I'm gonna do is let's just quickly put these together very easily and then I'll check the obviously the production and the coverage um, and then we'll go from there Uh, I actually, I don't know if I've ever said it, but fields are one of my favorite things in this game. Uh, it's kind of, uh, I don't know, the way it just kind of fills the gaps and things like that, it's uh, oddly satisfying. Um, righty ho, so let's get those things out. Uh, they're needed. For different things, but most importantly, this is needed. Uh, Workforce okay. shortage. Yeah, we know. And I guess we'll I upgrade it once more. Us. Perfect. And this island, I am hoping that we have a bit of fertilizer. Uh, no. So let's just check fertilizer. Uh, in the new world. Ah, interesting. Okay, so we're not delivering any any over here. Uh, we will now. Yeah, might as well. I don't think we're producing enough. Um, but we maybe. So let's just check. Uh, no, production fertilizer. Ah, uh, we actually are. Perfect. Okay. It's just gonna be a long, long time before it'll be properly distributed, basically. So that's fine. On the uh, side, it'll be over soon. Yeah, we'll pay. Are you finally in 
Um, okay, let's just check though. Orchids. Well, we're severely underproducing. I mean, we need half as much. Hmm. Okay. Well, I mean, this hasn't kicked off, so it's very difficult to say. If we'll put someone like Ferris or whatever, uh, we'll further boost this. But let's just take a look if we go for or kid farm oh i have not seen this girl um, okay hmm. kind of whatever 30 percent okay so he does 30 yeah th these things like 70 and whatever okay hmm. Yeah, we may need to get something like this. But that's okay. For the moment, that's fine. Let's just get this to kick off. And then we'll go from there. And this island has slightly too little storage to my liking. So that's why I have these guys. They're gonna load up on some material. And like this. And we're gonna build a couple of storage depots. Perfect. So the orchid now is being collected. I just Don't think that yeah, this is for the new world, so not too bad. Yeah, perfect. Okay. So that's all fixed. This will be fixed quite soon. Uh, I've placed, I don't know if I've had it before, I, I think I did, uh, but I have this now and I've placed, just in case we needed the coal deposit here or whatever, we can always change the, um, I think we might do it, uh, the reason for it is that uh, I would want to place a trade union just to cover them too, just to produce more oil out of them. Um, okay, but the main goal of this episode, guys, is to move the production, right? So, I'm actually very happy with the range of this, because we can cover this, uh, basically. But the first thing we want to be doing is to place that little thing here. Um, which is not so little, but we do need it, because... I do not want to be delivering items, so it's it's kind of crucial for, for us to have it here. Um, if I only knew where it was... Yeah, that message is there all the time. Uh, yeah, it's not too bad, actually. And if anything, we could potentially place it here. Yeah. Not a bad idea. So I'm just gonna move this. Yeah. And then... Have this. I don't think we'll ever need anything from mail here, so that's absolutely fine. The only thing that's needed is the aluminium, which is a bit of an issue, but that's okay. Uh, we have a ship... idle here so he's gonna bring some or I uh, know we probably need more but um we might have extra here actually when I think of it yes we do perfect I... we're gonna bring more anyway but that's fine so let's just get this guy and then we'll be able to shift the items basically back and forth um, but yeah, guys, I'm just gonna go back into the actual time lapse for this episode. Um, you know, the, the time lapse that I never got to do the last time around when, when George decided to go, go all out on us. Um, one thing is that, yeah, Benta is, seems to be 
Uh, quite strange. So let's say zero chance for a non-aggression pack, which is quite strange. What a selfless so let's just give her a bit of money. She, she needs it. She's paying for all of us. For all of it for us. So. Um, okay, so what was it? I guess we could take some of this as well. But definitely hundred. Okay, and let's just send that over here into this funny looking place. Um yeah. And we'll definitely need another like this. And I am thinking we might as well yeah, we probably will for sure. Maybe even third one. Mm. It's hard to know. Anyway, um, let me jump into the actual time lapse, guys, and we'll be right back. And here we go with the time lapse, guys. Um, so I decided to use the stamp tool for this. Um, didn't really work out very well, but um, yeah, that's okay. I wanted to kind of use that uh, somehow. Definitely. The stamp tool, to be honest, um, I think it's it's useful, don't get me wrong, but at the same time, I, I just think that because every island is different, every island would, has, uh, would have different topography, etc. It, it, it'll be always a matter of adjusting things and doing different things, basically, with it um, afterwards. But it is definitely helping out a lot, uh, so you can see me just adjusting the roads. The different things that didn't transfer with it because of the track that we have in the middle, etc. Mm, but other than that, it's fine. I, I think um, rather than for um, maybe buildings such as the production buildings, it it's more useful for houses and things like that, especially if you if you have perhaps. Um, a lot of the ornaments and different things, etc. So that's something that definitely be very, very useful for. Um, okay, so I'm just adding a lot of this stuff. Um, I'm going back and forth between the islands to make sure that um, I have as many as the other island did, because obviously the other island um, has what's needed there. Now, in the meantime, Anne is declaring the war. Um, nothing too crazy. Uh, it, it's it's something that we'll um, well we'll seize in the moment, uh, and 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 then she goes. Um, in here, I found it very challenging in 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 between those two islands to kind of move production, and I always really do, um, because it's not just a matter of. Um, production, I guess, or having enough building materials, etc. That's definitely very, very important. But the most important thing is is the fact that um, you need to make sure that you're delivering everything that you need uh, from the docklands, etc. Um, so that always takes quite a lot of uh, time. Anyway, um, another difficult thing that I always find is, is placing the local department. The local, the local department has a massive range, but at the same time, um, you do want to make sure that it does cover the entire island if possible. Um, which, not sometimes, it's not possible. Um, and you need to kind of fiddle things around. Um, as I'm doing now, I'm changing some of the routes, obviously. Uh, they have been delivered to Crown Falls, and now they have to be delivered here because everything is being moved over. So I've decided that the middle one will have three. I don't think it's needed, I just think that it looks very neat. Uh, two for such a small island, um, two tracks would be absolutely sufficient. There'll be no need for more. Creating additional routes because now, as things were being produced on Crown Falls, we didn't have to deliver them, now we do. 
So I actually need to build a few more ships, quite a few more ships actually, to, to be delivering stuff from here to Crown Falls. Now I think, um, and this is now going through my head, uh, that this island is way too small for what we need it for. Um, I mean, we've we've most of it now com completed and, and moved over, that's not a problem, it's just... Uh, there's more things needed, such as the the lemonades and all the different stuff, the souvenirs, and those buildings are absolutely gigantic. Anyway, the stamp tool didn't really work quite well because of the, again, the, the shape of the island here. Uh, but I decided to kind of make the most of it and fit as many as we can. And now we need to reroute the coconut and the cinnamon. As well as the soap and needs to be produced, uh, which I actually forgotten about. The soap is being delivered on Crown Falls and that's something that I'll change later on. So I am actually making a massive mistake here because the item that we have for it, uh, for all of the woodworks, uh, the gramophones and everything else, doesn't require a <laughs> power. Um, I actually spent quite some time kind of thinking where should I put it. Obviously the shampoo's needed, so it's, it's going to come uh, over and near them. But then <laughs> I've placed one near the woodwork but it's absolutely not needed and then in the end I have to move it again because I then realize that yeah that's what it is and it's needed actually elsewhere. Now I'm just looking for items. Um, this is um, quite uh, time consuming when it comes to the items because um, it's it's something that we don't really have them everywhere. Um, Crown Falls has some of them, etc. So I and at the same time I don't want to move them yet until we're 100% ready, if that makes sense. Because of um, there there there's still stuff being produced, etc. Other islands rely on Crown Falls uh, for steam carriages, for the Docklands, etc. So I want to be. 100% sure that everything is up and running before I start moving items. So I realize that we only have nine um, steam carriages. I think we probably need to add a couple more at least. Uh, but yeah, this is where the actual power plant needs to come. And now we are running out of bricks and I just decided because I actually been thinking um, I want to put them in kind of one corner I guess all of them together and uh, there's uh, they actually have quite a good few items that you can have um, them with I guess and um, yeah and I was thinking that let's let's go ahead and start doing it but then I just decided to leave them in, in this place because I don't know where they're supposed to go. It, it, it was kind of hard to figure that one out. So I just decided because we're out of bricks on really all of the islands. Um, yeah, let's just utilize the dock, docklands to have them imported. Anyway, so then I figured that it's time to move uh, some of the sewing machines. Uh, they are important because they're producing the steam motors. So they are being moved out. And again, I'm looking at items. And not everything is been, has been developed. So, or researched, I guess is the word I'm looking for. Um, so yeah. Now I figured out that I need to move the, uh, the actual power plant, but it actually works out so well. Uh, Cause it can just come into this corner. And 
The Crown Falls, I think I looked, I had 27 of them. So I said to myself that I'm sure I'm going to fit all of them. So I'm placing them away and you can see what I'm placing. <laughs> I have never realized until later. Uh, obviously I'm placing the shop tools or whatever it is. Um, instead of a sewing machine. So I will then kind of go back and forth to check uh, because now the... I couldn't figure out how come the population or the workforce is reducing if I'm placing the exact amount that we've had on the other island and we had over uh, over a thousand uh, of um, artisans, so that shouldn't be. <laughs> but yeah, it was just a mistake because of the size of the buildings, they're exactly the same. But that's okay. So now you're seeing me, that's exactly what I'm doing, kind of looking at different things and I'll get into items uh, to have them transferred over. Ferris, he's just uh, the best man that you can get. Again, sending all of the ships with the bricks because now they're delivered and bricks are just so so needed. So what I like about those little spaces is that you can really fit kind of the not really needed buildings but yet needed buildings if that makes sense. So always a bit of tallow, always some uh, wood and things like that to be produced. Um, so that's definitely something that I, I like about those little um, little spots. Now the local department had to be moved because it wasn't reaching the uh, sewing machines and uh, they are so so crucial because they're producing in addition to what I've said before the steam motors they're producing the advanced team, team uh, advanced weapons <laughs> um, yeah so now I've realized that I've placed the wrong buildings so I'm just replacing them very very quickly and I think in the end, I've placed 35, if I'm not mistaken. Just with this many. And there's still room for more if, if, if ever it was needed. Yeah. So then a couple of warehouses. I'm just grabbing this warehouse out of the other island. Uh, because I always take forever to find them actually on the um, on the UI. And then this actually, I, I absolutely love those. Whoever came up with um, with, with the warehouses on the water on the harbor city is a genius. So yeah, it's just such a neat building, especially when you're, I mean, these are islands, so why not? There is a, an item that I've never seen before, um, John Dalton, I think. That's something that I um, I want to get. I don't know if the game is incorrectly saying that they can be purchased at um, Eli. I've never came across, unless unless they're there, it's just they're extre extremely rare or maybe something else unlocks them, so it's hard to know. So the bikes then are moved, now I've mostly deleted um, all of the buildings, the sewing machines and the bikes, or the, the bicycles. And now I'm placing a bit of soap, deleting the shampoos. Again adding more items so they can be placed over here. I quite like that building, uh, the whatever railway station, whatever it is called. Uh, it's kind of big, but it actually it, it's okay. Um, I like what it does. It's it, it's providing fifteen 
15% uh, of additional um, productivity and it acts as a warehouse, so it's, uh, it's not bad. So there is still a lot of routes that need to be adjusted, a lot of them. <laughs> um, but gradually we're, we're kind of getting there, so it's not too bad. Now, we're struggling with work first, so um, I'm just adding the book that we've had. And now supplying the sewing machines. That That is so crucial. Uh, because of the fact that um, otherwise the population and the workforce will go down big time. Steam carriages have been fixed again. Anne is declaring a war, and to my um. I, I guess I must say, to, to, to my surprise, she's got the Dreadnoughts again. So I don't know how does that work. It just seems that after they are being attacked, they're much, much stronger. Um, so they can even respawn the Dreadnoughts, which is actually so surprising. I thought once you destroy the Dreadnoughts, that they no longer come, will come back. But they seem to be coming back. Okay guys, we are mostly finished. Anne uh, seems to be um, attacking us in the old world. Um, don't know what's going on. She just decided to go to war. It is interesting to see. Is she attack. just became very, very strong literally in just minutes. So um, yeah, that's, that's good. Uh, but yeah, I, I think what we're gonna do is... Uh, yeah, these guys should be attacking so we'll go for her here um i think once we delete or destroy at least a couple of them uh, that should be fine at least the big guy anyway uh, you can see he's um he's quite excited here but yeah he literally just one one attack one volley is is enough to destroy one of the cannons a uh, couple of cannons have been destroyed here as well. Uh, I want to see if we cannot rebuild it. We can now. Okay. So that so that's not too bad. These guys, I don't know Your if they'll be able to catch up. Uh, they should. Firing the and I mean, they're they've good items, like so there should not be an issue here. But we know how strong that battleship is. Um. So yeah. Your harbor is under attack. Where? Oh yeah, here, okay. Ship under attack. Your harbor is under Loading attack. Stations. Yeah. Let's just speed. see if we perhaps got an item. This ship usually has um the item that I that I very much like. Firing the engines. Quite a few. Mm. Not a lot. Oh, this guy, yeah. Delicious. Captain Jack Arrow. Give us time to turn. Yeah. He is just ever present. Loading stations. So let's. Oh yeah, he's good as well. Stations. Uh, but that's not needed. Let's just have them sitting here. Your harbor is under attack. This message won't go away. It seems. Um, these guys the want want to kind of come back and protect our harbor. Attack. 
Loading station. They have been getting excited and kind of chasing them. Uh, we've only four dreadnoughts here. Um, let's take a look at uh, the new world. I'm interested to see five. I think we've lost quite a bit. Count yourself lucky, you pimple. Yeah, let's go for I this. I don't need telling enough soon enough. Otherwise, it's just she doesn't do anything else apart from just. Stations. Uh, I guess annoying us. Right, so uh, this area New is, uh, well, the area I was going to switch over to the all the Cape Trelawney, but actually, since we're here, let's grab all of these and bring them to... This is tremendous exposure. Crown Falls. Um, yeah, so this is mostly finished. Uh, I do have to start out some of the routes, I think. It's kind of difficult to know what else we'll need if if they haven't been, I, I guess, utilized. Uh, but we definitely need more ships. Because we are now n not producing any of the... Yeah, so what we're going to do is let's bring them over here. Because we're not producing things like the shampoos or whatever over on the main island, uh, and so they have to be delivered over. Um, okay. So let's just see how we're doing here. I think we're doing good. to go with another one yeah let's let's do it such a pity that one another one won't fit here because yeah uh, but I think what I want to do is to yeah let's just fix this up quickly yeah, it just kind of looks apart. I, I just, that's what, what I left the space for, basically. Uh, it's just such a pity that, let's say, a warehouse would be perfect here. But it is what it is. It really looks very good. I'm, I'm very happy with... With the way things are on this island. The workforce seems to be... Have oh, we... Yeah, did we lose anything? Mm, we didn't. But we may be soon needing different things. Uh, but yeah, you can see now how much space we've gained. This then will go away. Uh, I'm actually gonna pause this thing here. It's no longer needed. Uh, this can stay there for a moment. And I think I'm gonna get rid of, uh, not the steel obviously, but the um, these things. The heavy weapons. Because... Yeah, because, I mean, we've quite a lot, so I don't think we'll have a trouble with, um, with that. And then when it comes to steam motors, we probably need couple and more than couple. So, okay, let's just not forget about the items. Uh, I always... This guy. For now, because there are better items out there, basically. Uh, gramophone factory, chemical factory, fun factory. Mm, yeah, matter as well. These for spectacles. But we know we're gonna put Ferris. Into the mix. Right, these guys have arrived. 
So what we're gonna do is one is going to be delivering shampoo. Where is that? Ah yes, perfect. Shampoo, there's still plenty on the island, so that's not a problem. And then the other one will be delivering... Hi. Um, hmm. Okay, we're full on brass, so that's fine. Uh, penny farthings, yes. Exactly. Penny farthings. Production has stopped. I, I don't know how many times we have uh, gotten that message. It's actually quite funny. Um, I'm definitely going to need more ships. Some ships obviously won't be needed anymore from here because things like, you know, whatever gold, whatever, th there is, there'd be no need to be delivering it over there. So uh, that's what it is. It is so interesting that this guy doesn't have his warehouse. Uh, but yeah. Okay, and here... What I want to be doing very, very quickly is to delete all of these. They're no longer needed. Uh, I obviously still have a lot of things to transfer, I guess. Um, but it's not an easy process, trust me. Um, yeah, it always takes forever. Because of the building materials, because of uh, everything else. And uh, But this is a good spot to have a couple of houses. I wonder, six and six, nope, uh, but that'll do, because this has to go anyway, so it's fine. Okay, and this needs to be moved as well, I just realized, uh, I have completely forgot that. Uh, for the moment, let's place it there so I can f finish up this little... Yeah, okay. There's really a lot of things, isn't there? I mean, it's absolutely crazy. Uh, concrete factories. Uh, I think we've only three... Yeah, okay. The lie bulbs and everything. The finishing touches. Yeah, the tea and makers. There. Interesting. I forgot Future about those. So this is now finished. You can tell. Oh, maybe it isn't. Oh, the beer festival. Oh, okay, okay, okay. So the attractiveness or whatever has kicked in. Um, but I can definitely upgrade a few more over here, so that's fine. And then we can get more investors once we get a s this island started. Um, yeah. It's 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 not the best. Definitely this one is much better for sure. Um, but this one will do. Because we are not going to be fighting with with Bender for now anyway. What brings you here, Master? Um so that's perfect. Okay. Guys, I think we can finish over here and before we do so, let's give our good old friend um, Beryl a couple of islands so she will need peppers mm, where is that over here yeah this is our old island she can settle So, Beryl is, is now driving around looking for a good spot. I think think she's going to go for the first one that's available. I am hoping she will not, but you'll never know. She 
she's gonna go come in this way for some reason i don't know conditions are verging on the inhumane scooped us oh, out of the she's gutter, now muted. She's well, now deciding what she wants to do. The cage you've built for yourself. Um, I think I'll just vac yeah, vacate all of the small islands. The only problem is that Bender will start taking them. But let's just check the paper. Yeah, I'm happy with that. Yeah, I think she's coming here. Yep. She's no peppers here, so. But I think you can get. Can you not get? I think so. A competitor raised a settlement. Mm, yeah, you can get this at uh, worker level, so she'll be fine. Well, let's just see what she's gonna do with this. It'll be interesting to see. She's got two islands. We we may need to just. I mean, if Benta will take that one, we'll just give her something else. That's fine. Plenty of violence available. Uh, and then in the old world, etc. I, I, I am hoping that she will be developed. Because Beryl is definitely, as far as I remember, she's definitely much, much stronger. So we'll see if, um, if that's the case. It's actually cool. Um, I must say with the AI shipyard because basically I mean you could really just play and play and play um, Obviously to until you you get bored of it, but um, yeah, other, otherwise you can k kind of keep going if that makes sense. So yeah hmm. I'm fully sure we had something here I cannot remember Yeah, I'm fully sure. With, with, yeah, I think maybe ornaments or something. Something like this, I think. It's very hard to know this time. <laughs> this time round. Uh, but yeah, the the Your unexpected, but now we know what it is, so that's good. Uh, at least uh, once, once we see this, if we ever to go to war with anyone, we know what it is. So that's good. And she's building trees. <laughs> or planting, I guess. Yeah. Right, anyway, guys, thank you very much for tuning in. I hope I will see you in the next one. And yeah, stay hooked.